Now that we've reacted to the music video, there are of course a load of B-sides to get into, including some remakes. Today. Oh, who loves the flow of this? Shoo oh. off! The emotion, the power, and then it just explodes! <laughs> okay. What's up guys, welcome back, my name is Shannon. Today we're going to be reacting to Itzy's Bad Girls R Us and Supernatural. The first two B-sides in the new Gold album. Bad Girls R Us sounds like, you know, a play of course on Toys R Us, maybe something along those lines. And I don't really know about Supernatural outside of that, it's something special, you know, something even outside of the natural occurrences. I'm excited to see what we are bringing here because Gold is actually incredibly different from a lot of the it's music we've heard before it almost feels like a, a, a cultural reset almost which it also felt like with the last album which was born to be so that's kind of interesting how it seems like now we're just doing you know resets on resets on resets but i'm excited to see what we're bringing we will also be getting into all of the other b-sides including the final versions of course so i'm excited for that too for now though we've got these two songs let's get ready to the first one belt girls are us Wow, that whole transitional thing there? Whoa! Oh, we're passing the baton a lot! That extra power. Oh. Whoa. Like instrumentally, I don't know what's happening. You know, I don't know what to expect next. Oh, I love that. The pre-chorus is so good. Hey! Oh, what a breakdown! <laughs> Whoa! That part right there almost felt like one of those YG asses endings, you know? It was just not an ending. Whoa, that like what whatever is happening in this song is so good. It's like there are three different songs in within this song, but all of them are still like all of them still feel like the same song. There's there's no mismatch at all. It most definitely feels like this is one coherent song, but at the same time, it's so different that it does not feel like it's on as its own song. It feels like you know it's three different songs. It almost feels you know you know kind of akin to how uh, like like the UK is like 
it's it's four countries but it's kind of only one country you know it's officially the uk is one country but it also consists of four countries this is one song but it also consists of three songs man it sounds incredible i love the tempo changes and the sound changes uh, well not really tempo change but at least the sound changes throughout the whole song are super super cool and that coupled with the way that they are changing their vocals the way that the vocals are quickly kind of flying in between them especially in the pre-chorus where the baton is kind of passed like instantly to each other i love that i think it fits the song perfectly i think the, it, it fits the nature of the instrumentals uh perfectly and it just sounds amazing their vocals really really hit it i love the power of their vocals i really love how leah and cheryong and and yeji are, are just you know the powerhouses when it comes to those really really loud and powerful vocals that come at the end of those uh, pre-choruses or, or was it the end of the courses i don't even remember but incredible song i i'm really really digging it it, it kind of it really built some energy you know it built, built some passion but we've got another song to check out in this video let's get right into supernatural Oh. Oh. The faint vocal on the current bass. Mm. Oh. Oh. So bright. Yo, that was, that was still uh, Oh, it sounds so good Then into the chorus like this Octave there is wow. Supernatural, yeah, yeah, supernatural. I want that supernatural. Supernatural, falling down to Damn, all right, that was Itzy's Supernatural. What an experience that was to get into. I really, I actually really, really love the, um, uh, what's it called, visualizer here over on the side here from, from NK because it kind of uh, really gets close to encompassing the feeling that you get while you listen to Supernatural. It almost feels a little space-like or like, like, I don't know, quantum dimensional. Like, it, it's something incredibly atmospheric. You get these almost psychedelic colors as you listen to these vocals that they are producing. And often, 
that would come from the instrumentals, but no, in this case, the instrumental is kind of what grounds us, and the vocals are what takes us into this supernatural sphere, this atmosphere. I love it. I think it works absolutely incredibly well. Like, the the way that the instrumental is so, again, so grounded. It's incredibly apparent. It's super, super clear. It's heavy. It's a bass. The That's how the instrumentals work. But... On the flip side, we have these vocals that are super high, they are super hazy almost, some of them incredibly faint, and that really works as an opposition to this really apparent bass. And despite the bass actually being the apparent part, and the vocals being that high, a little bit more faint part, it, the, the, the vocals come out on top clear as a day. I really like that. I think it's a super, super well put together song. The composition is amazing. The way the vocals are put together is amazing. It's probably, honestly, so far my favorite song of the album. But yeah, guys, that was It's These Bad Girls Are Us and Supernatural. Two really, really nice songs. We're kind of getting into a little bit more of a... Almost like a house vibe, especially with Bad Girls Are Us. It's And, and, and that's, I feel like that's a fun jump from Gold that was more so like a mix of rock and hip-hop kind of thing where the instrumentals was very rock-like but the way that we were singing the groove and everything and especially the chorus was very was very hip in that regard now we're getting into something that's got some that's got some kind of not grooviness that's the wrong word but that's what i was about to say but a little bit of a club vibe you know it's got that house music to it it's got a little bit of that edm kick where you want to move along to it it's not really as as fast as a typical EDM where you want to dance along and and you know do the choreography but you know it's got it's, it's it, it gives you movement it gives you energy it gives you passion you want to go into uh the, 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 you want to go into dance floor and actually dance along and I like it I really like both of these songs Supernatural probably so far being my favorite in this album I really really dig just this atmospheric vibe that we get within it and how it is created by the vocals and not the instrumentals where often it's created by instrumentals these hey like typical hazy synths or something like that that's not what we're getting here that's a bass that's a really really grounded instrumental where the vocals on the other hand is what brings us out into this like otherworldly kind of sound and i really like that i think it sounds incredible and and again probably my favorite from the album so far but we've got a lot of songs to check out still oh well two new songs but for now let me know what you guys thought about itsy's bad girls or us supernatural down in the comments below and i guess i'll see you guys next time Shh.